Well, ahead of next week's elections, Madison residents are not thinking about ballots, but their bottom line and how the governor's budget could impact it. The night team's Maria Guerrero joins us live from Madison's west side with the story tonight, Maria. Well, in April, there will be four official budget hearings scheduled around the state put on by the Joint Finance Committee. Madison won't be one of them, but the capital city is still calling into question budget cuts. I think there's still something we can fight on that, and that is... They met with the goal of having their voices power. heard, but for some, yes, there support. weren't enough here to listen. I thought it was an opportunity for us to come out and hear what the budget had to offer or what it didn't have to offer, more importantly, and there weren't, I didn't think there was enough people here. While not an official budget hearing, a crowd of about 100 joined city, county, and state leaders to offer up their own thoughts and, for some, <laughs> solutions to the budget crisis. Recently, a report was released by the Legislative Fiscal Bureau reporting that in 2009 there was $1.1 billion in under collected or under reported taxes in the state of Wisconsin. Um, in order to help b bridge the gap in our budget shortfall, I don't think we're going to see any increases in taxes, uh, but we could go after that shortfall. Others, like this pediatrician, are explaining the broken system that already exists with health care. I'm tired because I saw two women with very similar conditions but was forced to treat them differently because one had insurance allowing me to place her on appropriate, efficient medication and the other did not, meaning we had to make do with what we could. Though small, this crowd is determined they won't be silenced in the process. You will not quiet me. I will find a way to let you know how I feel. Thank you all very much. Thanks for coming. <laughs> And the comments tonight, both written and some of the video, will be sent to the governor and also the Joint Finance Committee, which will begin these official budget hearings in April in Stevens Point, Menong, Arcadia, and also West Alice. All right, the night team's Maria Guerrero. Thank you so much, Maria.